Sound check. Sound check. Game, game. Ito na, ito na. Wow! 1K subscribers and 4K watch hours. Finally! Tapos na! Eh, ano nang gagawin ko ngayon? Eh, di mag-a-apply naman ng monetization. Pero bago yan, intro muna! Okay guys, good evening. This is Kevside Channel. Wala po muna akong video. All voice over muna. And evening ko sinyot yung video. So, pasensya na. Adjust adjust na lang. So, itong video na to, ginawa ko just in case. Just in case, either curious kayo or gusto nyo malaman ang next step, kung anong gagawin. Kasi ito rin yung naging una kong tanong. What if makuha ko ang 1K subscribers and 4,000 watch hours? Ano na ang next step? Ano ang gagawin ko? So, in this video, papakita ko ang step-by-step -step process kung paano mag apply at ano yung lalabas sa inyong notification just in case ma-reach nyo na yung requirement ni YouTube. Okay, so guys, again, sit back and enjoy. Walang upuan, matumayo ka! Okay, ito yung email na isesend sa inyo ni YouTube once you are qualified for YouTube Partner Program. So, ito na, monetize ng mga videos nyo. Magkakaroon na tayo ng ads and so on, doon na papasok yung mga revenues. If wala kayong na-receive na email, pwede nyo i-check directly from the YouTube Studio. Ayan. And then, click apply now. Ayan. Okay, take note guys, yung apply button, lalabas lang once we have reached 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 watch hours. Ayan. As you can see, there are three steps. So, step 1 muna. Basahin po muna natin yung partner program terms nila. Ayan. I suggest guys na basahin nyo yung mga terms kasi marami tayong matutunan kung ano yung pwede sa abawal ko YouTube for monetization. For all we know, we are making videos pero hindi naman siya qualified for monetization. Okay, so dito yung nakalagay. Ayan. Ang haba. So, tama na. Pinating ko na. Accept na natin. Ayan. Click. Okay, we're done with the step 1. So, obviously, we're going to step 2 na. So, kailangan natin kumuha ng isang ball, pen, papel, sa calculator. Kasi magsosolve tayo ng math problem dito. Hindi, <laughs> joke lang. Okay, after mag-load ng ating YouTube Studio at nag na si Step 1, scroll lang tayo ng konti pababa. Ayan, at hanapin natin Step 2. And then, press Start. Ayan. And then, wait for it to load. Hintay na natin lumabas yung pop-up box. And then, may tatanong lang sa saglit sa atin si YouTube. Ayan. Okay, ayan. So, click lang natin yung drop down. And then, it will ask us kung meron na tayo existing account for a Google AdSense no, I don't have an existing account and I don't know so obviously, this is my first time on applying on Google AdSense so I choose no and then press continue loading loadan ko to ng 10 piso para lang mag load yan, and I would press yes you can also choose no guys, it depends on your preference naman. Yung may iba naman po tayo. And then next, pipila pa natin yung drop down ulit. And then we will choose the country. Ayan. So obviously, Pilipino ako. Pilipinas ang nilagay. Okay, next, ito naman po yung terms and conditions ni Google AdSense. So, kung napansin nyo, medyo mahaba. So, skip na natin, I think, yung part na yan. And then, let's click yes. And then, after clicking yes, let's proceed naman po in creating the account by clicking the create account button. Yan, okay. So, after nyo mag-load, 
Akala nyo tapos na, no? Step 2, not yet. So, we were going to click the Get Started button. Ayan. So, click natin siya. Okay. After mag-load ng Get Started button, pupunta na tayo sa form kung saan tayo mag-fill up ng ating personal details. Kung nakita nyo po yung pen icon, pwede nyo po i-click yan to edit kung meron na existing or kung gusto nyo po may palitan na kayo ng ilang details. Ayan. After filling up the form, obviously, isasubmit na po natin siya. Ayan. After we fill out the form, ganitong state na po babagsak si Google AdSense. It means po, nire-review na po ni YouTube ang ating mga videos for copyrights. Unlike step 1 and step 2 na automatic po after we fill out the form. This one, it will take 24 hours up to 2 weeks po. Ayan, so maghihintay po tayo. Yes! Approved na. So makikita natin itong pagbabago sa ating monetization tab under YouTube Studios. So scroll down lang natin ng konti. Yan. And then, makikita na natin yung video advertising. So, click see more. This time, is set up na po natin kung paano mag-work yung ating mga ads. Next, itatanong sa atin if we want to monetize the video. Of course, kaya nga po tayo nag-apply eh. So, yan. Click nyo lang po yan. After selecting monetize all videos now, is set na po natin kung paano mag-behave yung mga ads sa ating mga videos. Ayan, as for me, ginamit ko na lang po yung default. But you can also change, it depends po sa preferences nyo. So ayan, tapos na ako mag-set up. So i-click ko na yung apply preferences. Ayan, ina-update na po ni YouTube yung aking mga videos for monetization. Yahoo! May dollar sign na! So it means po, monetize na yung mga videos ko. Take note po in monetization. Kung yung videos natin, original tayo yung gumawa, full monetization. Kung nag-cover tayo ng mga songs, or kumuha tayo material sa other artists, half of it, original artist, half of it, yours, or none at all. It depends po. Check na lang po natin sa terms and conditions po ni YouTube. So guys, I hope you like my video. Uh, please like, bell, and subscribe. Salamat po!